going on sexy beast bald paper airplane here and today we're gonna be taking a look at the helion salvo that is not how you pronounce that whatsoever on round 50 so let's go ahead and get this shit started but you might be wondering why do we have the face cam i'm glad you asked that is because today's video is a sponsored video today's video is being sponsored by elgato's hd60 pro and let me tell you this is awesome and i love it if you are wanting to get started in youtube and you're looking to get a capture card this. I wish this was around when I started because I hate wires. I just hate them being everywhere. They get clunky. They're just everywhere. My feet. I just hate wires. This helps eliminate that problem. You only have to deal with one. You don't got to deal with 50 of them. So if you're wanting to get started with YouTube, this is where I would start. Less wires. It's easy to put in. If your computer can handle it, you just plug it right in and you're good to go. You don't have to be like a computer whiz or anything. It's very simple. You just plug it right in and you're golden. And also the main reason you get this is because it records your footage in amazing quality. I've always used Elgato, and I always will. They make fantastic products, and I don't see any reason why you should not have this. So if you are interested, check this out. It'll be the first link in the description if you're wanting to support me and Elgato. Go ahead over to that link and browse around, see if you find something you like, because I guarantee you will. They make some fantastic products, and this is definitely one of them. So, shout out to Elgato for giving me this amazing opportunity, and let's get back into the video. So the Helion Salvo, the Helion Salvo, however this thing is pronounced, you guys know I am not that well versed with uh, the words. This is an amazing rocket launcher. It's not so much as like your primary weapon, even though it definitely has potential. You can use it to clear waves. It, it can do that. What I like to use it for is the boss zombies, the werewolf, the blight fathers, whatever boss zombie it is, you name it, this thing is the greatest weapon to use on them. Not only because it is very, very powerful, but also because it locks on. Once you get this thing fully upgraded, if you're going up against a boss zombie that likes to hit the bench press a lot, this thing will lock on to them and it'll be able to take them out in like three to four shots depending on what boss zombie you're going up against. That is just like incredible, especially when you consider how much ammo other weapons take when this thing only takes like three to four shots and it locks on. So you're not going to be missing. It's going to take them out very, very quick. It also does wonders to hordes of zombies this is just almost a perfect weapon now it will damage you if you shoot it too close to your feet and honestly i don't even think phd is even worth it i think you'll be fine not having phd i think you can use this weapon without it and you'll be just fine if you want to have that extra step of security go ahead and grab phd but i really don't think it's necessary this is a powerhouse of a weapon i definitely see why a lot of people love it depending on what map i'm playing i usually grab it like if i'm playing dead of the night or if i'm playing nine or really anywhere that a goddamn blight father will fucking spawn in, I will grab this because it takes them out very, very quick. But if I'm playing in a map without a big, like, Chungus boss zombie, I probably won't grab this unless I'm doing the Easter egg. Like, if I'm playing on Classified or Blood of the Dead, this would still be like the Tiger Woods of weapons, but I don't think you would necessarily need it like you would in Dead of the Night, Voyage, or Nine. So this big fucking rocket launcher, I'm not even gonna try to pronounce its name, is great. I definitely recommend it. Great against boss zombies, great against regular zombies. You name it, this thing will absolutely destroy anything in its path, and hell, even you if you shoot it at your feet one too many times. So, saying all that, that is actually where I'm going to call today's video. Thank you guys so much for watching, and real quick, shout out to my lovely Patreon supporters. There's a rumor going around that all my Patreons are sexy as fuck, and that rumor just might be true. So if you guys would like to be a Patreon supporter, go and check it out. That link will be right down there below. And also, while you're down there, check out the HD Pro 60. If you guys could go ahead and click that link, it would mean wonders for me. Just pull it up, see if you find something you like. And also, follow me on Twitter, Instagram, Twitch, and Discord. And lastly, hopefully you guys have a fantastic day, and I'll see you in the next video. Peace.